5 minus 2 gives us 3. And 3 times 3 is just 9. So 5 divided by 9, which equals 5 over 9. But this answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, first we have to do parentheses then exponents, then multiplication or division, and finally addition or subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority and we have to work from left to right. And the same applies to addition and subtraction. In this expression, we have one division, one multiplication, and the one parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis, we have one subtraction. Here we have a multiplication because in mathematics, when a number is placed next to parentheses, it means multiplication and we usually don't write the multiplication sign for brevity. Okay, so according to the PEMDAS, first we have to do this parenthesis, then this division, and the finally this multiplication. If we do this multiplication before this division, it is wrong. So first this parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis, we have 5 minus 2, which equals 3. So, 5 divided by 3 times 3. Now, we have one division and one multiplication. As I said, multiplication and division have equal priority, and we have to work from left to right. So, here, first, we have to do this division. 5 divided by 3 can be written as 5 over 3. And here we have times 3. So 5 over 3 times 3. We can easily cancel this 3 and this 3. So we have just 5. And this is our final answer to this problem. The correct answer is 5.